Hey, y'all. Happy Easter and happy Sunday. Hope everybody is doing great. I have Mary Berry here with us. And we're going to do a little bit of bling today. So I hope everybody is doing well. Let us know if you are hanging out with your families, if you're hanging out alone, if you're crafting, if you're whatever you're doing, let us know how your day is going. We'd love to hear about it. Marilyn, how was your day? It was good, but I ate too much. <laughs> it was nice. I got up this morning and made some for my great nephew, and then we went to a service, and then we went to my sister-in-law's, and I ate, and I felt like I was in a food coma. <sighs> so I am happy to be standing up and blinging and talking and having fun, because otherwise I'd be comatose on the couch. So at least you're burning some of those calories. That's right. That's a good thing, right? That's right. The benefit of standing up on the line as opposed to sitting down. Burning right? <laughs> How was your Easter? It was good. Nice and quiet. I had to get some work done. Like I told you, like I was doing a few things. So somebody yeah. actually came over today and had to do some of the work this morning. And so I spent, eight. I went to eight o'clock service online. I intended on going to church today, but I ended up doing it online because I had somebody coming over and yeah. And my family's over. I couldn't even make it over to my family because I had so much other stuff going on today, but so he's gonna bring me some food so I can be comatose tonight. Going to All bed. Right. <laughs> so, so they, did you say somebody brought you some food? They're going to bring me some food. They're going to, oh, from the Easter thing. Yep. Gotcha. So, gotcha. you know, it's going to be like I'm there anyway. But hey, everybody, let's see who's here. Hey, Miss Sylvia Dinkins. Welcome. Hey, DKC Crafts. I just want y'all to know we're just going to bling and chill today um, and just hang out with y'all for a little bit. I don't have a template picked out, but I do have a tub of templates over there. And I'm going to pick something out and then I'll decide what I'm going to, like what colors it's going to be. So I don't have anything prepared. So we'll see. Hey, Patricia Johnson. Welcome in. Hey, Marta. Welcome. Hey, Creative Notions. Hey, Derica. Hey, Carol Coleman. Hey, Nomi. Marilyn and I are just going to be hanging out a little bit today. I missed her so much because I didn't get a chance to hang out with her on Thursday. She traded up for lobster. Yeah, I did. <laughs> and I don't really have any regrets except I missed hanging out with Marilyn. Uh, well, I missed you too, but you needed to get out and enjoy yourself. And I know the last couple of days you have just been working like crazy. I can tell from the videos you've downloaded. And I know you're doing other things. Yes, I've been I've been doing a lot of stuff, but it's all good. I still like bling. Like I need this downtime. So this is something that I need to just relax and just think of other things and not like, it's like a stress-free time for me right now. So I look forward to, to bling you. Hey, Erica. Hey, Miss Karen G. Hey, Nini. Welcome in. Hey, Gwendolyn. Hey, everybody. Y'all know I'm going to scroll down. So I'm so sorry, but hey, everybody, I appreciate you guys being here. Hey, Dempsey Boo. Dempsey says she's blinking and cutting templates too. I should send you the link. Oh, I think she'd be at work, but maybe on Easter they didn't. Yeah. I should, I should, I should have sent you the link. Cause girl, we're having a good time today, and we're only going to be on for for a few hours. I'm not sure if Evie's coming on tonight. Um, and we don't want to run into the time that Evie is on. <gasps> Guess who forgot to put their charger in, Marilyn? Me. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> I was just sitting there thinking about that, that I didn't put my charger on my <laughs> iPad, and it will go quickly. Right. So, Lynetta, this isn't usually my time. So, my regular time is Friday nights um, between 7 and 8, I come on. Um, sometimes if Delanda doesn't go on on Tuesday nights, I'll go on when she's not on on Tuesday nights, but I am thinking of doing a Sunday. I used to do Sunday afternoon sometimes talking about DTS and I think I may do Sunday afternoons. I don't know if I'm going to be working with my, um, Recoma, the, um, Marquee 2001 
or if I'm going to still maybe sprinkle in a little bit of DTF into that. I don't know how I'm going to work that around, but we definitely need to have some DTF conversations about just um, safety and um, like where it's because it's one of the most popular print methods right now and not just with DTF, but with the hacks too. So we kind of need to have some, some, some talk. But yeah, but Fridays are my day for certain. Any other time, it's just me hopping on because I need to talk to y'all or just get on here and do something. So yeah, 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 yeah. All right, Marilyn, let me charge up my um charger. But hey, everybody, I think I saw Gloria. I saw Miss Joy, Donzel, Miss Starla. Hey, everybody, happy Easter. I hope everybody is having a great day day. Robin, what, what are you going to be blinging out today, girl? So I'm going to bling out one crafty chick. And I was, when I got home from my food coma outing, I was laying on the couch for a few minutes. I just had to have a little bit of downtime, you know, 15, 20 minutes of downtime. But my mind was thinking, what, am, what colors I'm gonna, am I going to use today? And it made me think about this green shirt that I did for game day one week. So it said game day, and I used, with this green shirt, I used jet black outline, and then I think I used crystal AB stones for the inside side of it. Simple, but it is one of my favorite favorites. And so I'm gonna go with, to mimic, to mimic the crystal AB, I'm gonna go with icicles. Mm. The green and purple look good together. Yes. So to mimic that crystal AB, I'm going to use icicles. And then I'm going to use the jet AB again because it's really a nice contrast. And then for some pops of color, I'm going to use Violet Volcano. Oh, that's going to be pretty. Let's see how that looks. And then I'm not sure what my other shirt will be. Assuming I'm not a slacker, I'm too slow, and don't get around to a second shirt. If I get around to a second I'm shirt. I'm the one who's slow. I don't even have the template out yet. <laughs> if, if I get around to a second shirt, then I think I want to use light sapphire and sapphire AB. And I'm not sure what else. Because I don't even know what other template I'll do, but I have a lot in there that I can do. So I know I have plenty. Mm -hmm. But I'm also not going to put pressure on myself. You know, I don't have to do two if I do one and I do it slowly and enjoy myself talking with you in the chat. Then I might just do one. We'll see. One or two. I might I might get another template. The problem right now is that I'm, I never usually come on and bling an old template. Mm -hmm. So I don't have, like, I don't even know what I'm going to do because I usually do a new template when I come on when we bling something. I do have a template that I haven't done though. I you do. Huh? You do. And, and look at my shirt. Isn't this a gorgeous template? It's a gorgeous template, but it's a gorgeous, it's a great message. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful. But remember to be kind. And if you're in the chat and you got something like negative to say, just hush. <laughs> this is Patrice's design too. So if you're looking for it, it's in Patrice's store. But it's so swoopy and swirly and gorgeous. Thank you, Mayor Bear. And I think you have it in both ombre and regular. Is that right? Yep. Okay. So I did the ombre and I did mine in light rose. So the bottom of this, top of this is light rose. And then the other two are rose AB. And then, of course, Labrador. So gorgeous, of course. Y'all know how she is about her Labrador. I got to have my Labrador one so <laughs> Erica McNeil. So the buy-in is going on now. Um, I need to put links in the description. So I'll do that too, since I'm already behind anyway. Okay. But the buy-in is going on now. It's going to, and it started on the 28th. And the last day for you to enter or to get rhinestones is April 7th. You must okay. have your candy too. Mm -hmm. All right. Eight, seven. All right, so let me see what I'm going to do, Marilyn. I don't even know where is... I had some other templates that I had that I did not do, but I don't know 
where exactly did I put on you? Hey, tell you, hey, everybody. Hey, I'm me. I'm going to start where you left off, I guess. Hey, Rougie. Hey, Victorious Creations. Hey, Elevate Artistry. I don't know. She said hi to you already. Hi, Judy. Dems. Hey, Shay Shay. Right, I'm going to do two. I'm going to do two like you, Marilyn. Yeah, Gwendolyn, isn't it a gorgeous, gorgeous template? Thank you, guys. I can only take credit for picking the colors. And I might have made it on a live where I asked someone what colors I should use, so I can't even take credit for that. You did but Here was a question I had for you, Patrice, and everybody in the chat. You know, and sometimes we get off on these food tangents. Mm -hmm. uh, we've gotten off on old-fashioned candy tangents. Mm -hmm. But what is your, Patrice and chat, thanks Patrice Williams, welcome, hi Debbie, um, what is one of your favorite Easter candies? One of my favorite Easter candies. Candies? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And don't say jelly beans. You know what I absolutely love? Whoppers. So oh. the Whoppers, I love Whoppers. Oh, so it's, Pam does too. It's my favorite thing to eat at Christmas, at Easter, especially when it's like in the Easter egg. Like it looks, like, I love those so much. So you probably like malts. I love malts. See, Tim loves malts. I don't. I love shakes. So yeah. he loves Whoppers, and I don't. See, I love. Oh, you have more Whoppers. Sylvia says Whoppers. Tracy Johnson says Whoppers. Debbie, everybody loves Whoppers. Erica Torres. <laughs> it's my favorite. <laughs> uh, hey, Tony Jacobs Friels. Welcome. Um, Nikki Patterson's asking, where is the design? So, Nikki, are you talking about the Be Kind of Hush design? And Sandra loves Whoppers. Everybody loves Whoppers. Dorica loves Whoppers. Victoria yeah. loves Whoppers. You can't go wrong with that, <gasps> Marilyn. What's Did wrong you? with me? What is wrong with me? I don't like Whoppers. I know. What's wrong with you? Okay, here. I'm going to tell you what I think. What's wrong? There's, <laughs> we don't have enough time. Um, <laughs> candy coated mar I love candy coated marshmallows. Um, okay, <laughs> Teresa doesn't like Whoppers. When I was a kid, my grandmother in her closet had this bag, and I don't know why she kept it. It must have been some fancy dress. I don't know what was in it. But in the bottom of it were these round things, and I grabbed one, and I thought it was a Whopper or candy, you know, like a, and my mom's, no, 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 that's a, a moth, what were they called that you kept bugs away? Like mothballs? Mothballs. So then all of a sudden I connected mothballs to walkers. Um, I don't know why, but I still, I still don't think I like whoppers because I've tasted Tim's, yeah, mothball. I've tasted Tim's malts for and I'm really, you lose the flavor of the banana or the vanilla or the chocolate if you add malt to it. Mm -hmm. It's my story and I'm sticking to it. It's okay, Marilyn. <laughs> Star like give me three boxes of whoppers and I would have I am I love whoppers. And I love when they melt, like when you just have it, like you don't even have to chew it, like once it <laughs> actually melts. Oh, it's so good. I have not tried that since I haven't really gotten through the thought of wanting to eat a whopper, but I might have to give it a try. Yeah. I like those mints that are like that. I don't know what they're called, but they're kind of round and they're mints and you just put them in your mouth. They're kind of big and they just melt. The butter mints? Um, it's not a butter mint, but it's individually wrapped and maybe it's, maybe it's not a Florida thing, but okay. you get them in a kind of big plastic tub and they're individually wrapped and they just melt in your mouth. They're good. You know, they have peppermints like that. I love those are my favorite peppermints. Oh, I've seen those same thing with the green stripes instead of the red stripes. Maybe that's the peppermint. I don't know. Okay, so there's mine. Well, who said that? Who's oh bottle caps? Yeah, 
I used to love bottle caps. The chocolate eggs you can only buy at Easter. So I like the Reese Cup Easter eggs. I think the chocolate on those is better than the chocolate on a regular Reese Cup. And I like that there's a lot more peanut butter. Anything Reese's, gourmet jelly beans. <laughs> Cadbury eggs. I used to love Cadbury eggs. Now they're a little rich for me, but I used to. I used to them. So what what template did you decide on? Leo soft mints. I haven't really decided on one yet. I still gotta do a little more searching. Because I just don't know mirror beer. And I'm trying to find that be kind template. I put links inside of the inside of the description already in case. And I'll put this link inside of the chat. I keep thinking I can click on one and make it go over there. So Sandra said Leo Soft Mints. Maybe that's what they are. Leo Soft Mints. I've never paid attention to the name of them. Some restaurants will get them out too. And then T. Mont said you would love to have some in my. I, I keep a lot of stuff that restaurants have. Like, uh, <laughs> I actually buy them and then keep them. I have not tried the freeze dried candy, but. I've seen it. I should. I didn't. I haven't bought any because when I saw it, it was really expensive. But I would like to try it out. And I'm trying to think of the name of the crafter. He has a YouTube channel. He talks to you in his car sometimes. And he and his partner have a freeze dried candy business now. You guys might know who that is. But anyway, I know what you're talking about. They have freeze dried candy. So I'd like to order some and try it. Do you press the so Patrice Williams is asking, what do you, <laughs> what do you press DTF on shirts? LOL, please. Uh, Patrice, you're going to have to ask me another way. <laughs> I don't get it. Because you press, you do, I, like that's where DTF goes on shirts. So I don't, I think maybe we're missing something. What do you press DTF on shirts? Can, can you know, it, does it look like this or no? And these, I like think so. Was that individually wrapped? Did you take it out of a wrapper? Yeah, I have like thousands of these. Okay, so the ones that I get, they're in a clear wrapper, but I'll bet it's very, very similar and it like melts. Yeah, yes, <laughs> but I'm gonna look up Leo's soft mints when I get off of here. Hey, Gloria. Yes, Ken's Creations or Ken from the car. Yeah. Oh, Joni. I'm glad she liked it. Soft mints with the rounds. Yes, the one with the red stripes, Teresa. Those. Oh, okay. So that is Leo. That's the ones I'm talking about. Those are so good. I need to find those. Oh, Anita's bought freeze-dried Skittles from them, and she said they're addictive. Mike, okay. So, Miss Joyce, your comments are coming through. Well, at least I can see them, I assume. Let me look on my phone. Yeah, your comments are coming through, Miss Joy. Now, I have had time to work on people's lives, and it says something about, it hasn't happened for a few months. But there for a while, I was getting this error message and my comments wouldn't go through once in a while. So if you're getting a message, Miss Joyce, that says something about error, just keep trying. Hey, Sassy Mocha Crafts. Yeah, Miss Joy, it must have worked itself out because I'm seeing them come through. Huh. Were you getting an error message, Miss Joyce? Yeah. Sometimes, okay, sometimes with YouTube, what will happen if you're making back to back to back to back to back comments, YouTube itself will think that it's spam. 
So that does happen sometimes. So I don't know if you were making like comments and you're just commenting, commenting, commenting. Sometimes YouTube, so YouTube will block it as spam. But as far as anybody in the chat blocking anything, nobody's blocking any messages or anything like that. Like I'm not a computer. Marilyn's not. Dims be on her block game all the time, but she knows what I like and what I don't like. And so if she blocks something that I don't like, then I, I, I don't know. But outside of that, she just doesn't just block. Just to block. So it could be a YouTube thing. YouTube could be doing that. They do a lot of things. Hey, Marilyn. I think I have two templates out. I'm going to bling because Terrell's been begging me to make him one of the crafted bling shirts. I'm going to make him a crafted bling shirt. I haven't seen that template. I'm going to make it. And then I think I'm going to do, I have this other design that it's not on my site, but I made it before when we were doing patches. And it says like it girl, but while I'm doing it, I'll kind of explain it a little bit because some people are asking me, like, what exactly does that mean? And so I'll kind of explain it. It's not on my what you call it. So let me know when you're ready. Oh, Patrice was asking how to press them because she got 150 from someone and t-shirts. I need somebody to send me. Oh. That's a lot. Okay, so I press my DTF uh, shirts. I do um, at 325 degrees. Some people press it for less than that, but I find that my 325 degree press is good. So I press it for 325 degrees, usually for 20 to 25 seconds for that first press. Now you need to know whether the film is hot or cold peel. Generally, when um, you get like transfers, the person sending the transfers usually send like the press instructions. Um, but if they didn't, just on the safe side, don't peel it hot first, peel it cold or cool, and then see. Um, and then after it's pressed that first time, then I'll go back and press it a second time, but I'll peel the, the film off. Then I get a piece of parchment paper and I put the parchment paper on top and then I'll press it again for about eight to 10 seconds and then it's good to go. Like it'll be, it'll be perfectly fine. Lynetta, I have not because I think for next month we're going to be doing a tumbler. Um, so I haven't yet. I think it's gonna be a tumbler. I've been getting good positive feedback about us um, blinging out a tumbler. Now it's not gonna be a full wrap tumbler. You will have enough rhinestones if you wanna bling it out all over, but there's gonna be a design for us to bling together. But that is a lot, 150. Marilyn, you know I gotta go get my rhinestones. I didn't get any, I'm not prepared at all, girl. <laughs> at all. Take your time. I'm trying to think how far I need to have the one and chick apart for the word crafty to fit. Let me see. But I don't like I don't know the design. So it that's exactly how a party needs to be. Okay. Because yeah. usually when I have an outline, I don't separate them, but then on my shirt I did the other day that was one of my designs, I haven't spread weird. I think with my design I might have um made all of that into a compound path mm -hmm. and had it that way. Okay. And what I could do is I could go ahead and brush in the word crafty and just hold it over the outline to make sure I didn't do something weird to it. Yeah. I think I'll do that. And I'm going to start with a blue shirt instead. I'm going to do a black shirt for the crafty bling and the it girl, I don't know what color shirt. I got to see what color shirt I have. Okay. But... So here's what's unusual. You know, I always do a black shirt and I'll do a green shirt and a blue shirt. I guess I want spring to come along. Mm -hmm. <gasps> I had a spring design that I used to like. Remember that the spring designer had it said spring has sprung and bling has blown? Yes. That? Yes. And I should have worn, so a, either one year ago or two years ago, 
Uh, and you should have worn your Easter shirt today, too. We could have worn our Easter shirts. I know. So Caprice has a super, super, super cute Poppy Easter design from this year. It's adorable. Either yeah. last year or the year before, I made one that said, because I wanted, I like the picture of peeps and stuff like that. I like cute mm -hmm. stuff. So I said, or maybe it's a bunny rabbit. I don't know. Oh, well, peeps you are in peeps. I, I said, it was peeps, and I said, bunnies are cute, but Jesus. So, I thought about getting that out. I don't think I'm fit in that shirt anymore. It's like, okay, I don't want to humiliate myself. And not be able You're to I, I had a dream last night. I think I'm coming to the realization I need to be a little bit more healthy. Because I woke up in the middle of the night really kind of scared. And I had had a dream that I'd had to have open heart surgery. Ooh. And... For, for a tear. I don't know if your heart can tear, but my heart was torn. Oh. And the doctor came in and either I asked her or she just told me, I don't know if the surgery will be successful. Uh -oh. And I was like, oh, I better get her <laughs> start being a little more healthy. What did you eat before bed? I don't know, what did I eat before I went to bed? Honestly, I can't remember. Goodness, no. That's yeah, right. Donzel said he's never eaten Whoppers. Oh, no? Oh, Donzel, no. try them and see if you like them. If you like malts, you probably will like them. They're delicious. Hey, DB. Rougie, what did you just see at Justice Craft Therapy? So for my blue shirt, I'm going to use silver crystal for the outline. So if you're somewhat new, it was a nightmare, Bobby. Hey, Porgy Town. Thanks, Martha. Happy Easter to you, too. So for the outline, I'm going to use silver crystal and then... For the inside, somehow I'm going to mix blue flame, because I've seen that we use that lately, and light tepper. So I'm going to try. I hope I have enough blue flame. I don't know that I've ever used it. There's going to be plenty here. For one and shift, I'm going to use blue flame. And then for crafting in the middle, I'm going to use light tepper. My goodness, Marilyn. I think that's what I'm going to All right. I don't care about screens anymore. I'm not looking through all these things. <laughs> I'm over it. I'm, I'm not. I don't even care. I'm not doing it. I'm not. I'm going to nope. go try to find some um, stones. Okay. <laughs> so, Patrice and I were literally texting each other uh, 20 minutes before he came on. So it's not like we had plans for a set time or anything like that, but she had talked the other day about maybe coming on on Saturday or Sunday, doing a little bit of bling. And I know she was super, super busy yesterday. And then I don't know if you guys saw, but she had a new video on her new Ricoma. I think it's a 20 needle machine. Wow. Her video was phenomenal. So if you are thinking about a Ricoma, watch that video because even the bobbin she showed the bobbin really close up and exactly how to do your thread through it which way to turn it it was really a very good video and i'm trying to remember if it was 40 minutes or so have you guys watched that was it about 40 minutes it was super super detailed it was a very good video and then i started to watch a video today we were in the car on dtf and I haven't seen the whole thing yet, but on her two print head, I think it's called DTF printer, and she hadn't used it for about a week, so she was going to show what it looked like, and she was going to go through the maintenance process. But I couldn't—I didn't get that far into it before we had to go in inside where we were going. Anita, yes, it was super good video, and that's one of those things where you need those details. So. I appreciated it. 
probably not going to be doing the 20, 20 thread embroidery machine because I haven't even mastered my single needle yet. But I really, really love watching the video. All right, let's put these to the side and get started. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead. Thank you, Marilyn. Thank you, Marilyn. Oh, you're welcome. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do crafty first because, hey, Patrice, do you mind adding my table? I don't mind. Thank you. So in her design, the outline is one chick. This came because she was on a live one night and somebody asked, like, what's this chick doing or this chick this, that, or the other. And anyway, Patrice took it in stride. She laughed about it and she made it a template. So here's the inside of one, the inside of chick, and the word crafty goes between here. But I don't remember if I was smart enough to leave them alone the way they were or if I scooched them together. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and brush in the word crafty and lay it right down here on top of these and see if it's spaced correctly. So let's see. So we're going to start with, so the Allen's going to be silver crystal. The insides of my words are going to be blue flame. So crafty is going to be light sapphire. And what I find funny is usually I feel like this camera is lighter than colors usually are. Now yeah, let's darker. But that is my light sapphire. So this is the time of year caught my eye. What's it say? Let's make a hot fix rhinestone t-shirt with Marilyn. Awesome. Or with Marilyn that she announces it. With three syllables, the way my mama meant it to be pronounced. Uh oh, I lost my tape. There it is. So I was really busy yesterday and Friday. I had Friday off work. Really, really busy, but not doing crafts. Just trying to get my craft room set up and some of the some of the shelving that Tim and I have made, trying to get it trimmed out so it looks nice. So I'm this much closer to a craft room tour video. Can't wait to see that. <laughs> and then there's that room back there where I keep all the supplies that's a wreck, which if I'm going to do a tour, I'm going to show it, but I probably ought to get rid of a few things first. Don't worry, you know what the rest of our craft rooms look like, Marilyn? The same. Yeah. So, it's okay. And, I mean, I kind of like having all the stuff out where you can see it in there. I like being able to see my supplies. I know there's a lot of people that have craft rooms with the gorgeous, expensive kitchen cabinet looking things. It's all put away and you can't see it. I like seeing my supplies. That way you don't know where everything is. I feel like when things are in cabinets and closed up, you kind of forget that you have it. And then you overbuy, like me. Yeah. Yeah. I have bought things, even rhinestones, a couple times where I was like, oh, I want that color. And I already had it. So, um, thanks, Dee. Hey, Gail. Gail said she has the volume down because they are getting ready to have dinner. Happy Easter dinner. Happy Easter, Miss Gail. And I saw your message. Hallelujah. God is good. Rome, did you see your message in your group? So I read it through the chat. And I meant to look at the message. And I didn't look at the message. But I know from the chat from, was it your Friday night video? Mm -hmm. That was really, really good news. And I know that has to be such a huge weight lifted. Although, like you, when you go back routinely, it's, it's, still probably, yeah, it's probably hard to totally have it lifted, but there has to be a tremendous weight off her shoulders. Yep. 
So Adrian, Adrian says, how do you ladies find time to do all that you do working full-time jobs? I, I'm a teacher and find that I am just, that I just don't have the time. So I think it's hard to begin with, but I don't do nearly the amount of things that Patrice does. I don't know how she does. She's got that energizer bunny in her. It's hard. Mm -hmm. It's it is hard. It's a lot sometimes. Um, but I just find so much enjoyment in doing this that like that's what keeps me going because I love it. I love doing this. So that kind of gives me the the energy and I don't sleep often. Mm -hmm. Beautiful lady, Marilyn. I've been getting good sleep. Good for you. No, I don't what even do think it is. is. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe my body's reset. Oh my goodness, Marilyn, girl. I went and got a massage yesterday. And that massage took everything out of me. Like it felt good and everything, but I was just so drained and tired after it. It was so strange. You need somebody to come to your house that you need to teach Taylor how to do a massage and <laughs> you massage it like you know, nine at night. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yep. That's good. It felt so good. Well, I was tired. That's just like, you know, today we had talked about maybe coming on and I got home and I literally was in that food coma feeling. And so I thought, okay, I have to sit down for a little bit. I actually went there. And then in my mind, I'm like, okay, I'm ready. And eat. And like I'm thirsty much, you know, a lot of times I'll feel like, oh, I just wish I could just, you know, chill out, <clears throat> relax, watch other people on YouTube. But I always, always feel so much better. After, right? After it, yes, and during it. But I mean, once you get started, that's the hardest part to me is starting yeah and now i'm finding it difficult to do pre-recorded videos so i'm I trying know. to have at least one a week but i mean i used to try to do two a week, and i'm just finding that i'm not keeping up with that at all it's kind of hard doing the lives because the lives you know you still get what you need to get done with the lives you show a craft but yeah, it is kind of hard. Mm -hmm. It is kind of hard. But and the lives spoil you because the lives are so much more fun. You have yeah. interaction with all of you guys. You have interaction if you have somebody on with you. Um, you don't have to edit them. Yep. And so the lives, the lives really spoil you. Yeah, they do. And. But you're right, they are way more fun. Mm hmm Yeah. And speaking of lives, I need to figure out how to share my screen and actually have the, not just the window, but the pop-ups, you know, like when you go up to object and you see all the choices when you click on object or file, but the people in the video watching don't see those. So I need to practice or figure out just what to press because I, I rarely, rarely, rarely have ever shared my screen. I think the only time I've shared my screen is when I was doing the giveaway tool. So yeah. when I was on the other night, I didn't do it right. And so they really couldn't see what I was trying to do very well. I was trying to talk through it, but they really couldn't see what I was doing. So are you sharing, when you click share entire screen, that will show the pop-ups. Did you try to do that? So I think I tried to do that, but where you can say okay or share or whatever, it was grayed out. So then I went to a different one and when I clicked on it, then I had a blue, I think it was blue, where you could say share or okay or whatever. Now, when you click share, when you hit share entire screen, did you click onto the screen? Even though there's only one screen there, you still have to click onto the screen. Oh, 
okay. Okay. You want to practice it now and see? Sure. Okay. So, and then, yeah, because if you can see my little pictures over here, let me see if I have anything, because I think I'm on my school computer. So I'm going to kind of clear out of that, scooch things over. <laughs> so you yep. can you can barely see what type of file they are. You want to open up like a window, open up maybe. Um, oh, yeah. I'll open Inkscape. Yeah. And then you'll be able to see with the pop-up so that way we only see that screen. Okay. Adrian, don't be ashamed. It's okay. Sometimes, sometimes the machines we get, we see the machines and we really want to do it. We really want to, you know, learn it. But they can be intimidating sometimes. So don't be ashamed. But use the machine this week. Have you already gone through your training for the machine? If you want to go your machine, the machine training, then girl, don't don't be ashamed. Just start using it. But it can be a little intimidating. Oh, hold on, let me see. Hey, Linda Gray. I ran some show yesterday and I spelled a block. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> well, I'm glad you let it go too, Shelly Belly. <laughs> mm, I saw that. Yes, Lynetta. I'm in Florida. Marilyn is in Kansas. Kansas. Oh, Kansas. That's a commercial here because it has to do with, I don't know, the Wizard of Oz or something goofy like that. <laughs> Debbie Deshawn. Answer 30 in 2022. Okay. Inkscape's being stupid. Let me open up Microsoft Word instead. Okay. But when you click on to share, uh, just do share entire screen or present and then share entire screen. Okay, so present, share screen, entire screen. That's exactly the issue. I didn't click on it because I saw that it was the entire screen. I was like, okay, I can't share, but now, okay. Yeah, I know how to do it now. I don't. I mean, I won't do it because I know how, because now it's coming on. It's not blue. It yeah, it's coming on brown instead of blue, but awesome. Thank you. Okay, Marilyn. Now she's going to give us a, tu a tutorial, a live tutorial on making something. <laughs> <laughs> and, and this time they'll actually be able to see what I'm making. Yeah. They can see, but you know, it's really not very beneficial if you can't see the, the pop-up screens. You can see, like, but you were, when you were doing it, you were like talking and walking us through it. So, you know, you just kind of navigate that way. It was beneficial. Thank you. Well, and I did have a pre-recorded video on it for anybody that really, really, really wanted to learn how to make the designs, but. It just kind of took the wind out of my sails. Like, what? I know. This sucks. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. All right. So how are you feeling today about okay. you know, impending of going back tomorrow? Oh, my goodness. I've gone back and forth with am I going or am I not going? <laughs> <laughs> so I have gone back and forth at least four times. That's how I feel about my whole, you know, year. Am I going to go back next year? Am I not going to go back next year? Because yeah. I could, I could buy out and retire. And I feel like if you, like me, I'm like, okay, but I have to pay extra and then my income is going to be less my school income and I have to pay to buy back those times. And so, you know, but if I thought, okay, I can have my full income forever, then I'd work till I'm 80. And I don't want to, I want to do other things. So I'm really struggling. With that. It's hard, Marilyn. These are hard decisions. Yeah. Yeah. It's hard to turn back on them. Yeah. I mean, just, it's hard to have that feeling of the safety. Yes, Martin, we have met. We've been together twice. 
Yep. I was looking for a picture. Mm. It I didn't happen if we didn't take a picture. And it happens. Where is it? Marilyn, that was so long ago. That was like 5,000 pictures ago. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here we go. You now, this is a t oh, wait. That's not a good picture. That's terrible. I never take good pictures, but this one is really good of you and Eve. Look at me and my Marilyn. We were so happy. Look at these smiles on our face. <laughs> we're so happy. Uh, and the first time we met was up in uh, North Dakota. Mm -hmm. And Tim and I are walking into the hotel. And then I heard my name. And I'm running and hugging. <laughs> and it was, it was wonderful. It was. Because, you know, even though it's, it's virtual with all of us, mm -hmm. it's still real. Yes. Very real. Here's me and Marilyn from North Dakota. <laughs> and I have to absolutely love Marilyn because I didn't delete these out of my phone. Aw. Look at Marilyn. She's so sweet, y'all. She's a hot mess too, but she's so sweet. Oh, and sassy. So, Vera, I don't have any red blinged out shoes. That would be cute to have them on my shelf. Very sassy. Oh, Shelly Belly, I wish we could hit the lottery and just craft all day. That would be great, I know. great, great, great. Okay, so I told you I might not get two shirts done. I'm just enjoying hanging out. out. Mm -hmm. Me too. I don't know if this is tall enough. Yep. Oh, Mara Bear, this shirt. So this shirt that I'm making is the Crafted Wing shirt, but it's for Terrell because he's been crying about not having one. Uh -huh. I don't know how he's going to feel about me using Labrador for the outline, but he's going to have to be blinging a little bit if he wants a shirt. Labrador is a good outline. It is. It is. So you don't have to bling. Charlotte is a great community. You're right. I know exactly when the right time to come for you to retire. God got you. And this year, I feel like it. I feel like I. I feel like it is. I really do. But then you know the hi Nicole, hey Angel. But then the Angel thoughts of you know, <laughs> like the financial, more financial security of keeping the job. Mm -hmm. But I feel like it is time. I really do. I feel like it's time for me and you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and the thing is, is it's retiring from one thing. It's not retiring from working. Yeah. That's true. Oh, this sticky flock. Sticky, uh -oh. sticky flock. It's not right. releasing your rhinestones? It wasn't releasing that one, but I popped it out and then popped it back in, and now it's releasing it. I sure hope they go back to the regular formulation. I know. Okay. So let's flip this over and actually, yeah, yeah, let's flip it over. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I, yes, that looks like it goes in there. Yep. Awesome. So I think this is a good method to check. It's just, do a layer and make sure that your base layer is spread out correctly. Because I, yeah. right. I didn't do that right when I cut one of them a while back. That happens sometimes. That's yeah. happened to a lot of us. I know it happened to me and Evie said that she had just had that issue too. Mm -hmm. Anita Downey has two years and six months. Awesome. How did you like 
So Marta, I used my new heat press for the first time on a live that I was doing a few days ago or two, I don't even remember what day it was, and I like it. I showed the one thing I don't like, but see, I've never had a clamshell before. So it's, it's open and you gotta get behind it to put your temperature and your time on and all that. So you either have to kind of stand beside it and do the time and temperature, or you lower it slightly and do your time and temperature. If you lower it too much, it takes off. The timer takes off and you can't change it. Um, so I think if, if I were king for a day and I was worried about heat presses on that day, I would move the temperature and time thing to the right side because the majority of people are right-handed. So you can pull it down slightly with your left hand and adjust it with your right hand. But that's minor. It was $319. It's the same brand Patrice has. I use Patrice's link. I, Thank you, Marilyn. You're welcome. I use, it has a rollout bottom platform. And, um, you know, it's, it has more the sound. You can kind of hear the springs and that kind of thing of a $319 press versus a $900 press. I can live with that. It did a great job, so. I'm happy with it. And then I used it this morning again for the second time to make one of my other great nephews an Easter placemat. Well, it wasn't Easter design, but it was for him to use today for Easter. So I made a Mario placemat for him this morning. And so I like it. I like, I'll keep it. That is one nice thing about Amazon. If you get something that doesn't work right, Pretty easy. Make sure that it says return policy as you can return it. There are a few things you can return. But mm -hmm. no, I like it. I'm gonna keep it. I've really been wanting a larger press for quite a while. And I like it. Happy Thank Christmas. Thanks, Donzel. Thanks, Marta. I'm not sure, Donzel. We don't know if he's going live or not. I feel like she will, but I don't know because she does have a lot of family and all that. Hey, Kevin. Hey, Kevin. In his hello. <laughs> Every time you say it, that's how he says it. I can hear him you like that. Uh. So when you met him in person, did he say, hello? No, he didn't. I had to sneak up on him. I didn't know how I knew it was him. I had to sneak up on him. He was just oh. there and I was like, hey, don't you know who I am? <laughs> no, I didn't say that. I was like, Kevin. Sneak up on him and give him a heart attack. Yeah, but I did have to sneak up on him. <laughs> hey, D Smith, we're just hanging out today for Easter and we're just brushing in some old designs that we have. That's it. Nothing nothing major. I don't have anything new. Marilyn's brushing one of my designs in. Marilyn, do you have any new designs out? No. Oh, not the no, like, no. No. <laughs> disappointed in myself. Don't be disappointed in yourself. But, you know, I just, I told you before, when I was doing templates, I was just like template obsessed. Yeah. And I truly needed to back off of it because my mind gets going and then it gets obsessive on things. Mm -hmm. And I was like, okay. I'm glad I know how to do it, but I need to back off just a little bit because I was getting obsessive. You needed a break. Needed a break. Although I have one in mind that I'm thinking about doing. So, yeah. Soon. It's Whenever you do, ready. I'm not good at thinking of all these new things. And I see so, so many, so many templates coming out these days that look a lot of 
you know, based a lot on what you've done. Yeah, but this is the thing, Marilyn. When you make your templates, just you don't even have to think of anything that's like new or like honestly, like the the stuff that is I guess more common, like not trendy, mm -hmm. like more common things. That's what really is popular. Yeah. Because especially if you look at the like mama, like you could do a whole new mama. Yes. yes. And bling. And that's something that people will want because people want different things i'll wear a mama shirt all the time it can be a different style mama shirt but i'll wear it i'll, I'll still mm -hmm. want to like you don't I, have to now, with in my me. mother's day template that i made the focal of it you know having it here was mama mm -hmm. i don't even remember what the rest of the template said oh mama love is the best love or something like that yes but look at that like that's so that's it's something that people will want is it, it resonates with people like you want things that will resonate with with others but you don't necessarily have to go on like a trendy route you can do like you come up with amazing designs look at your spring vibes you have little flowers there i wore my shirt the other day Aww. now it's cute Yay. so just and sometimes it can get a little bit discouraging when you start seeing your designs but you ain't make the design like it can be discouraging when you see that. Yeah, so I do get a little discouraged when I see my designs, and it's like, yeah, you. But that is. Uh -huh. <laughs> I do, but it's. I awesome. just need to hire somebody that's creative in mind that can say, "Hey, you should do this," and then I do it, and I, you know, pay them for their, <laughs> for their thoughts because I'm not that creative. You are creative. You just mm -hmm. overthink. You just yeah. don't think. That's yeah. not, that doesn't mean you're not creative. You just overthink and you like to do everything in linear. Yeah, I do not. You keep saying that. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Where's, where's? Oh, Y'all know she First likes I design no. I can show. I'm not just doing linear. She's gonna go get one design that she didn't do in linear. <laughs> one design. <laughs> Here, this was from a long time ago. It is look not at, linear. <laughs> but look at that design. Blessed. Like you can say blessed so many different ways and put so you can put blessed with flowers, blessed with like Carolyn, you could it's it's so many different things that you could do. Don't don't think that you have to to get any like don't like you have good ideas. Well, and you know, then you get in your head, okay. I just I can't keep up with thinking of new things. I just can't, and then I like doubt myself because other people doing better and then i'm like okay so i should stay over here and do this instead i'm an overthinker don't overthink don't overthink thank you for sharing that import uh christine so the next zodiac sign i think is going to be taurus is it taurus or aries <laughs> she is she skipping aries <laughs> Maybe. Girl, you are a hot mess. Uh, Even though the Aquariuses are not really happy with me, I'm so sorry, y'all. <laughs> Aquarius is just so long. Like it I just, is. I was just like, oh my goodness. Like, what in the world? But Aries, I should have something for Aries by next week. Or maybe the end of this week. I actually started working on on it. So I know I've been slacking a little bit on it, but I've just been having so many other things to do. And I know that's, you know, not necessarily good. Oh, why am I tilted? But it's the truth. Yeah. It's in a lot. Hey, Miss Becky. Thanks, Joni. Oh, Renee said they finally had a nice peer day here on Long Island, 60 degrees. We got up to 80 today, and I was like, oh, this is hot. 
Mm -hmm. Now, Eileen, when it's 80 and stays 80, I'll be happy with that. Thanks, Mylene. Miss Becky, we are, we're on here. Just spreading happiness and love. Yep. And, and bling. And bling. <laughs> uh, happiness, love, and bling. Don't forget the buy-in, y'all. It's happening now. If you have any colors that you've been looking at and eyeing, now is the time. So Aries is going to go, even though even though Kevin just told me to skip Aries and just go straight to Taurus, <laughs> Kevin, <laughs> is that? Asa, she's a Taurus. Oh. oh, no, Marta, you got to do it. Marta's an Aries. <gasps> and Marta's birthday is on Friday. Happy oh. birthday. Happy birthday. And maybe Vera is an Aries. I don't know. She's talking about Aries. <laughs> Snow showers on Thursday. That's what Patrice and I were talking about before we started the live. We had about a week or a little more than a week ago when I got up in the morning, it was 25 degrees. And it got up into the low 40s that day. And then today it's 80 degrees. Mm. Mother Nature is a fickle beast. Mm -hmm. But I love her. <laughs> Mother Nature. Uh-oh. I'm going to go ahead and pre-press my shirt. Oh, I know what I was going to ask you. So, around here, you know, the upcoming eclipse is kind of a big deal because we'll be somewhat close to the totality of it. Mm -hmm. But is it at all like in Florida? Do people in Florida even talk about it? Because it's so far away. Will you guys even notice anything different? I don't think we're going to notice anything different. I know that, well, Terrell's going to Canada so that he can see it. Wow. Yeah. He's going to Canada so he can see it. But other than that, like, I know we're not going to be able to see it. Mm -hmm. but He'll send videos. He said he's going to send us videos so we can see it. He has like a camera or something. Like a lot of technology. So it goes across. You know, we go camping in Arkansas a decent amount. He goes more than I do, but we go you know, a decent amount. And so he and one of his best work friends, they're actually taking the day off. They're going to drive down and stay right under the zone of totality. Wow. And camp out and be there for it. That's going to be so cool. Yeah. Because you're going to be able to see, I know you're going to be able to see like some other planets too at the same time, they said. Oh, I think there's like two planets that you'll be able to see. Wow. I think that's going to be really cool. I ordered the eclipse glasses because the last full eclipse was in I think 2017 that we could see 2018 2017 and we had different administrators then and it was a big deal we had glasses and we ended up having to use more welding helmets because some of the glasses weren't rated correctly anyway so oh. about a week ago I was like okay oh, cool. what are we doing for this we probably should have been Thinking about this before now. So the I ordered some glasses off of Amazon for the students and they got here today and they are good ones. Because uh -huh. you put them up to your face, I can't see anything. And so really? I was worried about, you know, are they gonna be real or knockoffs? Mm -hmm. But yeah, they're gonna be good. They're gonna be good. Awesome. You're so thoughtful. Or thinking that far ahead, making sure that the kids have something to see them with. I think I've just been at the school longer than almost everybody there. Uh -huh. <laughs> you know, with with that comes a lot of history and a lot of institutional knowledge and, oh. and knowing what kids and knowing what everybody likes, and like yeah. how it boosts the morale and everything. 
And in 17, these kids were, you know, if they're 15 now, they were what, eight? Is that right? Is my math math and right? <laughs> uh, and so these are things that don't happen very often. Tim said, I can't remember if he said the next one isn't for 21 more years or 30 years. I don't know. Wow. And so it's just. I remember when I was a kid in grade school and we went outside for an eclipse and we had to draw this, we had to poke a hole in something and then look at it on paper. I never saw it. I was like, I don't know what I'm supposed to be looking at, but I don't see anything. But the experience, you still remember the experience. I, I definitely remember the experience, yes. Y'all, I'm drinking out of my bottle I made. Look how cute it is. Yes, very cute. Uh, wait, hold on. Ooh. Yes, Lynetta. 2045 is what you're... Okay, so 21 years. That makes sense. Yeah, Stacy... Or when is, yes, Stacy, looking through the welding helmet. <clears throat> so our welding helmets at school are rated a 10. And... You're supposed to, I believe, have 14, whatever that means, the darkness of your helmet. So the teacher told me that in the last one, he ordered these inserts to make it, to increase the darkness of it. Uh, but then I ended up just getting the glasses because they only have like 35 rolling helmets and that would make it we have to do all these little bitty short shifts for each kid to have the opportunity to see it. Yeah, and I just felt like if we can all go outside at the same time and kind of make it a little festive thing. Yeah. Maybe I should make an eclipse shirt. <laughs> I'm not Maybe. making an eclipse shirt. I'm not, at least I'm not making an eclipse bling shirt. Oh. Maybe a DTF clip shirt. Yes. That could be a good excuse to wear jeans that day. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And that could be a good excuse for you to. Well, I was going to say you could do a video about yeah. it, your design, and then doing mm -hmm. the video. Mm -hmm. Well, Nana, now I'm not sure if I answered you. I answered you in my head, but this is an HTV Rock Paper. <laughs> this other one that I still haven't even plugged or turned on, well, I plugged it in. I haven't turned it on is. I think it's called Brig Brig Sun, B R I G B R I G Sun. Yeah. And, uh, I'm thinking Thursday I will actually get it turned on. I still need to add the handle. And then maybe Thursday I'll use it. Oh, thanks, D. Oh, I'm being in slow. What'd you say? I said I'm being in slow. That's okay. Really quick. I know. <laughs> okay, so it looks like one is pretty well centered over chick, so I can just center the whole thing. <laughs> Miley, I bet she is looking for this bottle. <laughs> Famous C Creations. Hey, everybody. All right. Whew. So this is on brushing in this SS6. My favorite. <laughs> then it's probably also Black Diamond, right? SS6 Black Diamond? Yeah, I'm using a little Black Diamond today. Awesome. Dorica, are you still here? <laughs> Dorigo's <laughs> probably like, child, finally she don't use black diamond that much anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so Miss Becky, yes, I think that is right. The buy-in ends April 7th. Mm -hmm. And the eclipse is April 8th. Thank, Thank you. <laughs> Okay, 
okay, so with this shirt, I folded it to find the center, and the center isn't really the center of the V. Mm -hmm. So we're just going to kind of split the difference. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we're just going to wing it. We're going to wing it. That is the downside of a V-neck shirt is there is what appears to be a center <laughs> from the bottom of the V, and sometimes it's not really the center, but it's going to work out just fine. Thanks, Nomi. It's going to work out just fine. Dee Dee, I'm not sure. We're not sure she's coming on or not. I don't recall her saying she wasn't, but I don't know. I know she has a lot of family and grandchildren and all that, um, but I don't know. I think she might, because I don't remember her saying that she wasn't coming on. Yeah, I don't either. So, we're going to be off by the time it's time for her to come on so that we can be in our hangout spot, our, our Sunday night hangout spot. Right. Hey, Miss Janita. Hey, Tammy. Miss Becky, I love my black diamonds. Black diamond, this is my favorite color, y'all. My favorite, favorite color. And in my favorite size. <laughs> hey, that's pretty darn close. We're going with it. My favorite color. Gorgeous. Oh, that looks good, Marilyn. That's the icicles, right? This is, nope, this part is the um, silver crystal. Silver, oh. uh, icicles, if I do the second shirt, will go on the green shirt. Okay. If so, I don't do it today, if I don't get around to it today, I'll do it Thursday. Okay. Because I really want to see what the green icicles, the violet volcano, and the jet black would look like. It looks like. Silver crystal is one of my favorites. It kind of surpassed, um, what's the other one that I like? I can't even think of it. It's the, uh, not Crystal AB. I love Crystal AB too. Jonquil AB? Not, I love Jonquil AB too, but what's the, you know the transparent one? Oh, cr Crushed Ice. Crushed Ice, that's Crushed Ice. Silver Crystal has kind of taken over a Crushed Ice's spot. Even though I still like plus dice. Hey, Valerie. Hey, T. Valerie. Hey, T. Welcome in. Hey, Simone. Oh, Dee Dee. So the colors on my shirt are Labrador. And then the top and the bottom is light rose. And then, no, 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 that's wrong. The bottom of the top word and the top of the bottom so these two i'm touching now those are light rose and then these are rose ab and then this is patrice's design tammy i do too and i tend to gravitate towards certain colors and i just ignore my other colors looks like I need to be a little more well-rounded with color choices. Remember, we're supposed to be doing that. We're supposed to be using colors that we don't use often. <laughs> I don't. Um, okay, I am because I don't think I've ever used this blue flame. Oh, the blue flame is so pretty. And the light sapphire. I know I've used it, but not very much. Now the silver crystal. And my Labrador, they are still a staple, so I'm going to have to use them. Okay, I feel like the next layer I should put in is the insides of these. You agree, Patrice? So that I know exactly where to put that last crap. Definitely in. agree. Definitely agree. All right. And then these, I know I'm going to have to put them in separately because I did move them. I moved the one over, and I think I brought it down. So I'll press them in separately. 
I will make it so much easier for you. Hey, Georgie Lee. And then Dee Dee is asking for your colors. Um, so I'm using, so this shirt is going to be for male. So I use, well, generally I wouldn't necessarily use Labrador for a men's shirt, but it's going to get Labrador today. So I have Labrador, Black Diamond, and Jet Black. And I'm putting a little bit of Jet Hematite in here. I don't know why I put the, the, okay, here it is. A little bit of Jet Hematite. And then what are the only colors I'm using for this one? Janita, I love the Rose AB. And I really like how it pairs with the light rose. More than the rose? Yes, oh. I do, because you see a little bit more distinction. I love it still with the rose, but I like a little bit more distinction with the light rose. Hey, Kristen. Hey, Kristen. Happy Easter. And then, I, then, I think you? that's good because sometimes that light rose can kind of get a little bit lost sometimes. Mm -hmm. And I think it's really nicely blending in with the rose ab yeah kind of gives it more its definition or something um janita's asking what colors are on the shirt you're wearing I um, think colors you're wearing i don't know on the shirt let me see i know it's red it might be light cyan i don't think it's candy apple so it's um jet it's a uh, black diamond with gold cyan metal light and then cyan on the inside so uh the outline is that diamond there's a gold and cyan outline inside and then light cyan just pouring this blue flame out i'm like wow that is so pretty <laughs> there's so many different colors of stones in it yeah or or colors when you look at different angles i'm not really sure yeah i think it's from the different angles yeah that's a blue flame yeah yeah oh my goodness the blue flame and the green flame are so pretty i've used the green flame once i'm pretty sure i've never used the blue flame but wow i like it <laughs> So that means I'm gonna if I do this other design, I'm gonna have to get some colors that I haven't used. <laughs> if we have time, we may have time. I'm almost ready to press this. We're really just hanging out and chilling, y'all. We're not even I'm not in a rush. Marilyn isn't in a rush. No, I'm really just enjoying this. Yes. Yep, yep, yep. Me too, Mayor Beer. Me too. So what am I going to do tomorrow, Marilyn, when I have to go back into the school? Oh, you're going to take a deep breath. You're going to say a prayer of thankfulness for seeing the light of day. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this morning, so after my bad dream, I woke up and it, I can't remember if it's Viola or if it's Vivian Crosby. One of them is very much appreciative of, thank you, Lord, for letting me see this day. Mm -hmm. And when I woke up from that bad dream, that's exactly how I felt. I was like, I felt. oh, thank you. And then when I knew it was a dream, I was like, thank you. I have another chance. Aww. <laughs> that was a, that was a nightmare. It was. That was definitely a nightmare. Whatever you ate last night, don't eat it again tonight. I can't even remember what I ate though. That's the bad thing. Mm -hmm. Have to ask Tim. <laughs> <laughs> I honestly think I just had. I know what I have now. I just had some sliced turkey and some sliced ham lunch meat and a cheese with mayo sandwich mm -hmm. which i eat a lot so i don't know why it made me 
do that. Of course, you know, I sit there and snack through the evening, so it's probably something else. So there's one odd stone in here that looks very different than the rest. Well, give it out. Right. And they really do stand out. The ones that don't belong, you can uh -huh. tell. Long. <laughs> like, yep. Yeah. Like, if you have one stone that looks odd, either be like Dems and have a bottle of odd stones or throw it in the trash. Uh -huh. You don't want to ruin your whole shirt for that one stone. That's what I'm going to do. I just, I have a little, it's like a, it's not a drawer, but it's like a little holder. Uh huh. Pins. I have so many rhinestones in there. <laughs> <laughs> So I can see if I were to get down on this, it's a low profile Berber, you know, just an inexpensive Berber carpet. If I get down there on my hands and knees, I could pick up a lot of stones. <laughs> I bet. I bet because you, you rhinestone so much. <laughs> for some reason, for some reason, my rhinestone addict sponsor has not really helped my problem no <laughs> she has not <laughs> that is true yours hasn't either nope <laughs> it's really good so we have to find new sponsors but i don't think anybody in the chat could be our sponsors either because they got it bad too i don't think so uh d is asking if you're doing an ombre yeah i am now is that a design that's in your store no this one isn't in the store okay i said i don't remember seeing it before but i might have it's not i actually digitized this um but I was, yeah, I don't even know. I was, I digitized it, but I haven't stitched it out. So maybe one night on the other machine, on the, on Broski, Broski. I'll, I'll stitch it out. I think I'm going to do one night, a late night. When, when are we going to do some embroidery, Marilyn? Because Chris said that we should do, well, the other day she said that I should do a late night um, embroidery session with Broski. That's what Chris said. You should. And I could work on my little baby machine. Yep, your husk of Barna. Yes. So that's been. And we still have to do our candles. So we have a lot of stuff to plan. Oh, I forgot all about the darn candles. Oh don't my god. Forget. How did I forget that? I was just about to tell you, don't forget about those candles, because girl, we're gonna be making those candles. Because I was all thinking about getting into it for a while, and then all of a sudden I just another <laughs> I have my biodegradable litter and everything. Kristen says she's doing her best. She's doing her best not to get caught up in this rhinestone situation. Kristen, I don't blame you. Somebody <laughs> <laughs> she said you could make a mix. Miss Janita, I don't usually get a lot of mixed stones. Like I don't usually drop a lot of stones on the ground occasionally if it's a stone that's on the ground it's because i took it off the table and i like flicked it off the table because it was the mm -hmm. wrong color <laughs> but other than that not too many so i don't have a mixed container but i think this does have a mixed container he does yep yep when i'm brushing mine back into the lid i'll have one or two that fall on the floor um, Kelly, we're not sure if she is or not. And Miss C, this I think is my first time to use Blue Flame, and I might be using it more often after this. I think it's gonna look amazing on that blue shirt. I do too. That's gonna look so good. So, Kristen, <laughs> Kristen was just mentioning the candles, and we started talking about them. <laughs> Miss Sharon Davenport has a mixed container. Now, she should have a mixed container because as much bling as she does, she's the real, like, will the real bling master or queen blinger stand yeah. up with her? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. 
She said, I can be walking and see something shiny in my carpet and don't think I don't get down there and get my stone. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. So Rosetta, this uh, template, which is actually Patrice's template, the colors are Labrador, which is a silver metallic stone. And then the top and bottom are Rose B. And then the top of the bottom and the bottom at the top, so where I'm touching now, those are light rows. Wait, let me make your shirt bigger because let me make, let's, because we need to see that better. Okay. Isn't it pretty? It's so, that it's, is really pretty. Such a good template. Okay. So going back over the colors, Labrador for the B and or. And the outline, I think. Actually, that outline looks like black diamond. The outline might be black diamond, but it would be just as pretty as Labrador, or if it were Labrador. And then Rose AB for the top and the bottom, and then Light Rose. And I really like the Light Rose. I feel like I have it on crooked. There, I'll just walk like this. I <laughs> I really do love that light rose and the rose AB together. But I'm pretty sure the outline is black diamond. I don't think the outline is the Labrador. Oh, that looks so good. Thanks. It looks it's so good, good Mayor Bear. Thanks for the great design. She's going to say, make me small. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't. I didn't even think about it. I'm, I'm graduating to... Not being as as nervous, Nelly. <gasps> of course, you know if you left me there very long, I would say that. I know. The other night when Delanda told you to make her small, <laughs> I know. I thought, oh, that's me. <laughs> I was like, yes, yes. <laughs> tell her, Delanda. You tell her. <laughs> I'm so happy. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that shirt is so pretty. And you know what I think too? I think that the light rose kind of toned down the rose A B. Because usually rose A B can be kind of like a, a brighter shade of like the pinks. Mm -hmm. Kind of like if it, it goes so well with it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's a, a soft muted color to go with it to help it to help it do that, help tone it down a little. Yeah. Hey, Sheila Cushionberry. Sheila was out in her garden. Sheila. Sheila, do you know if Eve's going on tonight? Thanks, Renee. Let's see. Is my shirt straight? Let me see. This is a lot of bling with this Labrador. Y'all know Marilyn's one of her favorite colors is mm -hmm. Labrador. It's just such a beautiful outline color. And it's so pretty to mix with the Armadillo. Yeah, it is. It's really pretty. And then on my last Serial Crafter shirt, I did rose gold and something i can't remember and it turned out gorgeous with uh which what with labrador it was i can't remember what i put with it but it was rose gold mm -hmm. the metal stone rose gold i think it's a metal stone and it was gorgeous too so i think of those three is kind of similar they're labrador yeah rose gold also, and then your rose gold just nice neutral colors yeah And the rose gold, you get like your pink shade, but then at certain times you get copper. Mm -hmm. I think it looks really good. Like little mini brand new pennies. Mm -hmm. But I did it on a dark blue hoodie. I just can't remember what color I put with it, but it was cereal cracker. Famous Jazzy G. Welcome in. 
I'm dropping my stuff. I'm just joking. I'm just kidding. I'm the desk. She talked, she's talking about getting her hair washed, which made me think of my darn fingernail polish. I finally have to take that off. I was like, I'm having to touch this up every two days, and then it starts looking clumpy. Your, your fingernail polish looked really good, Marilyn. When I took it off, I was like, oh my gosh, I hope those ladies that work in the fingernail places, which I've never been to, that looks good, Patrice. I hope they wear masks. Oh yeah. That stuff you have to use to take it off is terrible. Yeah. The nail techs in my salon, they they always wear masks. Okay, good. Well, I think because because of, because of the pandemic all day like that. Mm. Yeah. I couldn't stand it just for fifteen minutes. No, it's it's true. It's a lot. And then no. they're in all the time like that. Mm. Yeah. A lady at work, she uses these, she calls them stickers. I don't know if stickers is the right word. But she gets these things that you press on your nails. Like press on nails? Or I guess. And or she decals. said she, or what? Decals. You know they call like the, the full it's a full nail cover okay so i guess they're press on nails she said she loves those and for spring break she went to florida and she said through showers through the ocean through everything they last she said like two weeks hmm. so i don't know but i am you're done for a little bit <laughs> it's okay I have I have paint on my toenails all summer long, but not my fingernails. So I still have a lot of this little chip left. So I'll be able to get multiple shirts out of this. Cool. That's what the chips, you still get a lot of stones in them. Even though they're they appear to be small, there's mm -hmm. still a lot of stones inside of there. Like mm -hmm. you can get a few shirts out of it. Especially like if you're not doing a design that has like four thousand rhinestones in it. Right. Okay, what colors are those? Um, so this is Labrador and then the top part is black diamond of bling. So I could actually leave it like this yeah be fine but i'm gonna go ahead and put in the rest and what color is the rest gonna be so the hyphens are uh jet hematite you guys aren't gonna probably oh see i it. see the hyphen and then the, see a hyphen. the bottom part is jet black jet black okay i was hoping you were using jet black so it'll still look like the black of the shirt but it'll have a little bling to it. Yeah, has some glitz and glare. But the only problem with the like doing the jet black with the shirt is like it's so hard to see it. Like, I it's <laughs> like that's like this rhinestone tumbler that I never finished because I was doing zebra stripes. And mm -hmm. so where the silver of the stripes are is not difficult to do. Putting jet black rhinestones mm -hmm. on black paint on a oh. tumbler is really hard for my eyes to see it's hard it's <gasps> oh no i just realized this is supposed to be ombre what did you do what did you do so i i used i used blue flame for the whole thing oh it's fine it doesn't so the design comes in in ombre or not ombre yeah. so i'll just pick up the top half and then i'll layer in the bottom half or actually i'll do the bottom half first and then add the top half back in yeah i didn't plan for that i wasn't thinking ahead and i don't even know why i brushed it in seeing it the whole time being spread apart because <laughs> usually i would pick ombre over solid so of course i cut it as an ombre Hey, Jesse. Is Jesse here? Hey, Jesse. Hey, Penny. 
Just and there, I might do a giveaway with it. Not this one, though, but. Okay. So I better pick that one up or I'll knock it and then I'll be not happy. Oh, so anyway, if you buy a template that's ombre and you don't want to have to cut ombre and regular. So like a lot of Patrice's, she gives you the two options. You don't have to cut both of them. If you cut the ombre one, you can do what I'm doing. You can just press it in two layers. Patrice, that's gorgeous. It's so pretty. It I don't is. know if you like all this bling on it, but you better enjoy it. If he doesn't like it, you take it back and you either wear it or you send it to me. <laughs> it's so pretty. So this is Labrador. Labrador. The hyphens are jet hematite. And then the inside of the outline is black diamond at the top and jet black at the bottom. And I love the jet black on, on the black shirt. That looks so good. It looks pretty good. Really, 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 really. I can't remember what I used that on a while back, but it was, I was filling in kind of like that on a black shirt with an ombre. I think it was cheap. I was going to do two different colors, and then I liked, once I put the top half of Jeep on, I liked mm -hmm. how the bottom half was still black on the black shirt. So I think I filled it in with the jet black, and I loved it that way. So good. And jet black is a funny song because you think that it's not going to, like, have sparkle to it, but it actually mm -hmm. does have sparkle to it. Mm -hmm. And then it doesn't hurt pairing it with like a color like Labrador because yeah. Labrador makes everything around it shine and sparkle. Labrador makes everything better. Yeah. <laughs> kind of like Silver Crystal. Silver Crystal though I think is like, whoa. That's one of the most beautiful stones I think. But it's very similar because you guys know like the rim is Labrador and then the inside is um, just a crystal stone, but the neighbors are having are doing karaoke outside. Are they? <laughs> They're singing Justin Bieber. I hope you guys can't hear. <laughs> <laughs> I did karaoke one time, and it was like, and I feel like I'm an okay singer, and it was awful, <laughs> awful. Because when you sing to the radio, it's easy. It's easy. Well, I'm, we're going to have to go karaoke one night. Uh, uh, we do live karaoke. Y'all know we're going to have to make sure Delanda is here because she swears uh -huh. that she's a singer. So we're going to have to do a karaoke live one night. <laughs> that would be hilarious. Yes. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. We might get copyright strikes, but it would be hilarious. Yeah, right? <laughs> Yep. Maybe that might have to be a Zoom. Dakota just walked in the room. Hey. So, Lynetta says, I'm sorry, I'm trying to buy an ATV Ron key press on Amazon. One says the word smart white on, and the other one doesn't. Oh, white one, blue one. Are they different? So HCV Ron does have two colors. They have a white one, and then they have one that's similar to this color. This is not an HCV Ron, and it's a blue one. So I'm guessing that's what the difference is. Okay, Sheila. Let's see. I thought she said she would be here at Sheila because you're married. Okay. So we assume she will be on. Good. Do we have time for another shirt? Sure. It's, we can do another shirt. And by the time we do that shirt, it's going to be time for Evie to come on. It's going to be time for me to get ready for relaxation in bed. Because I got to be out of school tomorrow. Marilyn's going to relax a little bit. Right? Right. 
I think I like this shirt a lot. I think I want to make a new one like this. <laughs> Terrell is not getting that shirt. Mm -mm. I know you better wear it for as much as you've been crying about him not having a craft of bling shirt, and I have one. <laughs> Later, Jesse. Thank you for hanging out, and happy Easter, Jesse. Bye, Jesse. Tim oh. says she's joining that live. What? <laughs> Tammy says she's joining that live. <laughs> or when we do, hey, Lisa, when we do our, we need to do a karaoke. Let me, uh, let me, let me text the Londa Patrice. <laughs> let her know. <laughs> Mark your calendar. But that might have to be a Zoom, y'all. That might not to be a true, true. A YouTube live, but that might be able to be a Zoom. I think it would be fun. I do too. All right, so the next design. Now I kind of want to do something different. Oh, Marilyn, decisions, decisions, decisions. Decisions. Hey, Mona. Decisions. Cheryl says she thinks she was a singer in another life. I think I was too. Thank you, Whitney. Happy Resurrection Sunday to you. Yep. Lily, I get my KT a mask from um, Heat Printer Warehouse. And Patrice may or may not have a link to Heat Printer Warehouse in her video description. Because uh, I know she gets hers here too. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'm just going to do what I can. So I think I'm going to do the in between word. First, to figure out if I'd want to ombre the chick with the same color I used for the in-between work. I don't know. Sounds fun. <laughs> Girl, I was like, oh, no, it sounds fun. Yeah. All right, Mary Bear, I got to go see what shirt I want to put this on, okay? All right. Okay. So let's try to get this in there where it goes. See, looks like you tilt it a little bit. That looks good. Right there. Nope, nope, nope. Move it down a little bit. Layering the stones. Okay. Well, that looks good. It's hard to see the colors on this one. I'll hold it up in a minute and show you guys the colors from the front. Now, sometimes tone on tone doesn't show up super well. I'm a little bit nervous about the word crafty. I don't know, guys. I don't know if crafty's gonna show up very well. It shows up, doesn't it? Okay, let's keep going. Where are we gonna go with it? Because I could use Labrador for crafty, not Labrador, but um, Silver Crystal, I know it would show up really well. But we're experimenting today, so let's just go for it. Thanks, Renee. Oh, thanks, Sheila. Where do you watch? Whoops, it jumped. Where do you watch? True Crimes. Yeah, because I know she has some lady that she likes to watch for True Crimes. I can't remember the lady's name. Me, Annie Elise. Annie Elise. I like Annie Elise. I like... So Annie has a really good um, YouTube channel, a and &E, And I like... There's so many that I like to watch there's so many it's so <laughs> i don't even know what to do with myself okay i gotta I, I i picked out some stones but i'm kind of staying with my whole black um black diamond but i'm gonna bring in a little bit of black diamond ab with it can, can i see that i can't even on the camera i can't really see the blue flame 
Well, you can see it. Hold on. Let me make you big. We can see it. You can see the blue flame in there? Oh, oh. oh yes. And turn to the right and to the left. I could see. Oh, yeah. I think I'm going to stick with the blue flame for the bottom part of shit. I think that's going to look good. Thanks, D. Thanks, Don Zale. So, Rosetta, I'm using SS10s and Patrice is using SS6s. Yeah. I'm going to stick with my SS6. All right, I think I want to get Sapphire one second. Here. Thank you, everyone. Okay, so on this last layer that I did, I had to cut the letters apart because sometimes your shirts will shrink or, you know, as you're pressing them multiple times, they just kind of shift around. So I am expecting, okay, there's one stone on there I do not like. So we are going to remove it. It's hard to tell which letter, is, which one it is though. But I may have to cut these apart because I did have to cut the last, the last layer apart. See, I've never even watched Annie Elise, and I watch True Crime a lot. Okay. So, let's see if I can figure out how to get this one stone off I don't really like. There we go. It fell on the shirt somewhere. So, this is how I get stones on the floor also. I just pull my shirt up. There it went. fell to the floor. But I didn't want to accidentally leave it on the shirt and get it pressed in and mess up my design. Okay, so yeah, I can tell the shirt somehow twisted while I was pressing because on the screen the design fits perfectly together and then you start pressing your shirt and sometimes they don't fit together perfectly anymore. So at that time you might have to cut your design apart just a little bit. Heroin. Yeah, yes. You were large for a long time and you didn't say anything. <laughs> I was waiting. <laughs> Patiently. But you didn't say nothing. Then say a word. Nope. Did you leave me large when you left me by myself? Mm-hmm. Well, <laughs> I didn't even notice. <laughs> All right. So, did you hear back? Does Delanda want to do uh, karaoke? I didn't. Te I didn't text her yet, but you know, she probably want to do like a concert. <laughs> she she probably really want to do a concert. So, I'm gonna have to. I know she had a few things that she was doing today with the family. So. Maybe we could do. Maybe like one Saturday. Sounds good. <laughs> Sheila said large and in charge. <laughs> large and in charge, Marilyn. Right. <laughs> oh, Renee, I love Joe Kendall too. You love what? Joe Ken Joe Kendall. He he does he's ha he has a show on um ID. The blonde headed older guy? Like silvery blonde head? Yeah, silvery blonde. Yeah. He like for being an old guy, he has perfect hair. That guy? Yeah. Joe Kendon? Yeah. Yeah, we have a teacher at work who has like perfect hair. You know, most older gentlemen don't have that kind of hair. Mm hmm And even both my kids who have this teacher, they're like, yes, this is perfect hair. My husband's going somewhere. We're just pulling it in. <laughs> Tim hasn't brought us any water yet today. What? Tim hasn't brought us anything to drink yet. No, usually when he comes home from Sonic, he always brings something, but I know. I think he was downstairs napping. Oh. He probably was tired. Did he eat a lot today? He he yeah. <laughs> tired. That's understandable. He he was in a food coma also. <laughs> he needed a nap. Yep. That 
is okay. So he falls asleep with the TV going um, very easily. And so the weird thing is, is if I'm not trying to fall asleep, mm -hmm. I fall asleep with the TV going. But when we got home today, I was like, I'm going to try to take just a quick 15 minute, you know, close my eyes. And I'm on the couch. He's like, be careful, watch TV. And I'm thinking, you can't fall asleep with the TV. I'm like, okay, I'll move to the bed. <laughs> okay. And then, you know, I came back out a little bit later and he's, he's out losing away. Okay, so I have a couple stones that I took out because I wasn't real fond of the coloring of them. I'm going to go ahead and replace those now. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm just going to press it first. To me, it's easier to see exactly where they go when you press it first. When you press it, yeah, I feel like that too. So is Tim going to vlog on Tebow and Mo for the Eclipse? Um. Is he going to vlog on T Bo and Mo? And then what'd you say? When he goes to camp oh, out. Oh, you know, I think he's planning on it. Yes. Not live, but um, I he's think he's planning on doing a video. I think that would be cool. That would be super cool. Tell him we will watch. Mm hmm. Oh, somebody said your, oh yeah, your face is frozen. Oh, as usual. We'll wait it out. Hopefully, it'll just catch back up. Can you still hear me? Yes. Okay, perfect. Yeah, and your table's still fine. So, and you look good in your frozen picture. Oh, so, it, you. it's not like your mouth is wide open or anything weird like that. <laughs> <laughs> So I, I froze at a, a, a nice spot. Yeah, here, I'll take a picture. I'll show you later. It's always nice if you're going to freeze to freeze with a good pose. That's true. Yeah, you, look, you look great in your frozen. There. <laughs> hey, you're frozen. Sometimes I'd like to just freeze like that and, you know, not have to worry about anything. Just be frozen. I look cute. Okay, so let's get that back out. Donzel says nice pose, but oh, this is the wrong one. A nice pose, Patrice. I also brought out the Black Diamond AB, which I don't know if I've ever used, but I know I've said this before, but Angel B's shirt at Bling Fest, she said it was Black Diamond AB, and it was nice. Yes. So I really want to use that sometime. I don't know if you saw it, but she posted a picture of the boys on the, uh, oh, now I lost, uh, Sky Deck in Chicago. Where oh, I saw that. Like the thick acrylic under you, yes. Brought back memories of, we went up and did that. And, but we were in the Sears Tower. I think she was in the other newer, taller one. I'm not sure. And my daughter was so scared she wouldn't go anywhere near the outside of the building. Mm -hmm. That is a little nerve-wracking, though. Yeah. And especially when you grow up in a town where maybe you see a three-story tall building. No, I would say downtown there's probably four stories, maybe. I don't know. Yeah. Yes, Kristen. She's concentrating really, really hard over there. Yep. Not taking her eye off her project. Or nope. blinking. Not even blinking. <laughs> That's dedication. <laughs> that is dedication. <laughs> I'm going to refresh in a minute just to see if I don't have any drama when I'm refreshing. Oh, yeah. True. Hopefully not. Might leave me alone for a while, guys. Exactly. Well, you're used to it now. You've been on the big screen for so long. Like, I left you on for a few minutes, and you were fine. You didn't yell at me like you did? No. No. 
maybe a year ago, maybe a little a year ago, but not now. Okay, so I'm done with this shirt. And so, you want it? Oh, okay. Can you still hear me, Patrice? Give me a thumbs up. Okay, can you make me big for just a minute? Not forever. All right. So that's pretty from the front. It looks pretty much blue, which is interesting because that is not what I thought it looked like at all. And then on the sides, you have all those different colors. I think I'm going to get a little closer. Hopefully this looks okay because I'm not going to be able to see the screen from where I am. Well, yeah, I can. I can back up and look at it. Oh, yeah, there we go. See the gold? The gold and the different colors. Some green, some blues. And there it looks blue. But even some purples. Very, very pretty. It looks awesome, Marilyn. Thank you. Oh, you came back fast. Mm -hmm. I tried my hardest this time. You did a good job. I gotta hurry up because we have about 20 more minutes. I need to, I flipped some stones over when I was facing the transfer tape off. <laughs> oh, I gotta, I gotta those. So I think that I'll save my other shirt and do it on Thursday because we have 23 minutes and Patrice can work on her other shirt. And I can watch the chat, but I like this. This is so, so pretty. pretty. It is so pretty, Mirror Bear. There we go. That kind of shows it. So the oh, outline, the outline is silver crystal metalites. The word crafty in the middle is light sapphire. And then everything else is blue flame. And blue flame is one of those stones that from different angles, it takes on different colors. It's not an AB stone, but like the rainbow stone, it takes on different colors from different angles. But I think every stone pretty much has the same colors in it. It just, it's a color shifting type stone. Yeah. So pretty. It's really pretty. And it looks really good with that shirt. Yeah. Looks super good with that shirt. Cute templates. My first time to make this template. Oh, thank you, Marilyn, for using my tips. You're welcome. I think I'm going to use it again on Thursday. So, on Thursday. Because she's one crafty chick. One crafty chick. <laughs> that is why. But you are the original crafty chick. <laughs> According to the guy that was in or the girl that was in the chat. I know. People are so weird. Yeah. Well, they never necessarily she was crafty. They just called her a what's chick. this chick doing. I have one shirt that says one comfy chick. Remember, Kalanda was like, oh, this chick is getting comfy in my in my <laughs> jacket. <laughs> so I do have one that says one comfy chick. Oh, all I remember is telling the person her name is Patrice. Oh, thank you, Nero. Yes, whatever, you know, blah, blah, blah. Anyway. People are weird, but it's okay. Yeah, they are. You never know. So, on Thursday, I made a shirt out of this color. I made this color. Oh, you can make me a little smaller now. Oh. Thank you. Completely forgot. Uh-huh. On one of my shirts, it was this color, and it said game day. And it was outlined in jet black, and the inside was crystal AB, and I loved how it turned out. So, I was talking about this earlier. I think I'm going to do one crafty chick again, but whatever I do on Thursday, I'm going to use jet black for the outline on this shirt. And then to mimic the crystal ABs that I used before, I'm going to use icicles. So, icicles is a silver-based stone, but I'm going to put it up to my upper camera. I think Patrice called it a princess stone or something like that, which really does um, describe it. There's purples and kind of flecks of 
slight gold, slight blue, but the main thing that jumps out at me with the icicles is the crystal and little flecks of purple. It's not showing great up there, but this is gonna mimic the crystal AB that I did on that shirt. And then I'm going to use for a pop of color somewhere, I'm gonna use the Violet Volcano, which is shades of purples and it's violet purples. So they're bluish purples. Mm -hmm. I think those three together will be really pretty. And mm -hmm. I think purple and green look good together. And so that's what I'll do on Thursday is use these three colors and some template, maybe one crafty chick on this shirt. Whatever you use, Marilyn, we're going to be there on Thursday. Thanks. Dem said she loves using icicles with violet ice. I don't know that I've used them before. I'm glad you said that, though, because I was sitting here worrying, okay, there's multiple colors in this and multiple colors in this. But I really think violet ice, the main thing you see is the silver, but with little pops of purple. Mm -hmm. So, look, I'm all ready for Thursday. You're fast. No stress on Thursday. I just know what I'm going to do. I like Violet Ice with Violet Volcano. Like, I love those two together. Mm. I still have a little bit of Violet Ice. Not a whole lot. Oh, mm. good, Stacy. Okay. Because sometimes that upper camera doesn't do great. Gail, be safe going home. Yes, Miss Gail. Hey, Terry Hunt. Patrice is my first time, Patrice Williams, it's my first time to use it, and I like it, too. It's very pretty. Thank you, guys. Thanks, everybody. Hey, Breezy. Hey, Breezy. Breezy's here? Uh-huh. Congratulations on your grandbaby, Breezy. Oh, I didn't see that. I can't yeah. believe she's old enough to have a grandbaby. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I saw her. exciting. <laughs> Thanks, Rondria. Alright, let me see here. Alright, I gotta hurry up and brush quicker so we can press and travel over to Evie's. Thank you, everybody. So many positive comments. Oh. <laughs> My lean says about the Chicago building. If I'm that high, I expect to see Jesus. <laughs> uh, that is high. Uh, and Sheila said, if she's that high, she wants to have a whole building around her, not just be over the edge. Mm -mm. I'm scary. I would not be to do it. Gail, we think he's coming on because Sheila said she talked to her yesterday and didn't say anything about not coming on. Okay. You're welcome, Breezy. All right, let me uh -huh. get the transfer to. Oh, I got 16 minutes. Marilyn is handling this chat, y'all. I'm gonna just be the the chat the chat queen. You always are. Like I'm always the one that's like not doing mm -hmm. well. You always do great mm -hmm. with the chat. Hey, yes, you do, Marilyn. Sometimes I feel like I don't even look at it, and then I feel like, what are you doing? You I forgot to watch the chat. You do great. Me, not so much. You, very much. That's your press, Marilyn? Oh, it's about to go. Yeah, I'm going to turn it off. <laughs> Patrice, she just acts like sometimes she's not watching the chat to extort money from me. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. Uh, here's what she'll do. She'll ask me a question. Mayor Bear, are we going to do this on Thursday? So I'll answer her. She doesn't see it. Five minutes later, <laughs> 10 minutes later. Mayor Bear, are we going to go on Thursday? Uh -huh. I'll answer her. 15 minutes, 20 minutes later. Oh, I think the same member wants to go on Thursday. And she sends me $20 with the answer. Yeah, so do a super chat. <laughs> yes, I have to pay you to read my comments. <laughs> Marilyn, <laughs> you know I will 
go back and read the chat later. Sometimes I do. Lately, I haven't been having a chance to like really go back and read the chat, which is not good. I don't go back and watch mine because I don't want to see me. But I'm I'm impressed though that you know a lot of times you do. Yeah, I will go back and read it because so sometimes I miss a lot of things. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Rondria. You're so fresh, Marilyn. <laughs> fresh. I know. <laughs> oh, Lita, you would not know what to do if I wouldn't. You'd be like, what's wrong with you, Marilyn? <laughs> Lita says, hi, I'm new here. Checked your Etsy shop and can't find them. Are you looking for Patrice's designs in her Etsy shop? Because now she puts most of her designs in her online store, which yeah. is craftablethings.com. And Marilyn's, y'all know Marilyn's Etsy? No. Yeah. Marilyn's Merch 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 Merch. Yes. So mine is just Marilyn's Merc, M E R C, named after a grocery store that was in the town where my grandma lived called the Mercantile. So it's Marilyn's Merc. Mm -hmm. Marilyn's Merc. You're welcome, Lita. Okay, so this is the new design that you said you hadn't tried out, or is this an old design? Oh, no, this, this is the old... it girl that you were going to tell us the meaning behind it. I forgot I was going to tell you guys the meaning behind it. So it is, it's, it's, so it's not in my shop. Um, and what it means is, is that it says it girl, but the T is actually a cross. That's why the T is so much larger than the I. And so the I represents like the person and then the cross is covering the I like me. Oh. So that's kind of what it means. And yeah. I like it. It, it. It's not just it girl, but it's, you know, it has more of a meaning, but it's actually a cross. Nice. Thank you, Mira Bear. You're welcome. Linda, Linda said, I finally went back and watched my lives. I had some good laughs at myself. Oh my <laughs> gosh, I just can't forget. I think it was her first live when her daughter's in it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Her hard time, and she's like, Oh, my daughter is Laura G, or whatever the daughter's name was. Her daughter. <laughs> and it was her daughter. So the daughter was in the chat, and the daughter was on there telling her mother, Linda. And it used to be uniquely, it was Linda Gray, then unique, uniquely Linda, I think. So she's back mm -hmm. to Linda Gray, I think. I'm not, what's your channel name, Linda? Has two, two channels now or two main two YouTube names? I don't know. Um, but her daughter was in the chat, for anyone that wasn't there, telling her mother in the chat that she needed to finish her, what was it? A, um, was it quilt? Cool? Yeah. And Linda wasn't seeing that to know it was her daughter. And finally, she figured out it was her daughter. <laughs> yes, Linda, that's the one. I was just laughing. And Linda is so cute. Yes. She is beaming all the time. It's just infectious. Yes. Even when she's having a hard time with that rug tufting thing. Or her... She's smiling through it. Long arm, I guess that's what it's called. The long arm embroidery, maybe. Or quilting machine uniquely done thanks Vince. yep she's just smiling and being so pretty yep just smiling meanwhile by that time my serious face is on i'm just like zoned in really definitely not reading the chat at that point <laughs> know anything oh. and she's smiling and grinning away talking and laughing with us <laughs> she was Lisa, thank you. She said she really enjoyed watching your lives. Now she wants to jump off the fence and get into crafting and not be nervous to try. I'm not computer savvy, so I had a hard time uploading, downloading, etc. Yeah, so if you're not computer savvy, that start can be really overwhelming. But once you understand how it works, it'll be easy. But yeah. I understand you don't know what you don't know. And so on YouTube University, there's a lot of videos about downloading files and all that. So yep. I hope you join the crafty 
the crafty crew. Yes. Yes. And craft at your own pace. Yeah. Like, don't worry about, like, what everybody else is doing. You find something that you really want to do, and you do that. And then, you know, you can always move to other things, but craft at your own pace. All right, guys, I got okay. one more part to brush in so we can hurry up and make it to... Did Eve put her thumbnail up already? Let me see. Deb said she met Linda last week, this past week, and had lunch with her. I think she said... She did. Oh, Gail. Gail said she was starstruck when she met Patrice. Everyone is because she's so awesome. Gail, I was starstruck when I met you. How about that, Miss yep. Gail? You were all blinged out and everything. We had such a good time. Yeah, that was fun. I don't see her... I don't see it yet. It's not in my notifications, at least. Okay. So that means we may have a little bit of time. All right. So we're going to have time to press it in. I'm going to press it. Uh-oh. Some of my stones popped up, but that's fine. Let's see. What does Patrice's shirt say in the colors? Okay. It says, Mama established... 2005 and the colors are black diamond for the outline there's a thin outline on the inside of it and that is gold cyan metal light and then the inside is light cyan it just says mama. mama renee says she sees something for eve and then creative notion says it's set for 8 48 oh Ooh. you're past it could have been like five minutes ago yeah a different time for her yes it is don't worry we will make it lisa you're welcome maybe she just didn't move it to like scheduled. maybe she just said pop up live and she's just not coming on tonight the only time i've seen her come on early was when we went on early to do the embroidery stuff oh yeah which we need more embroidery so yeah. Yes. Chris, if you are there, Chris, we are going to do more embroidery. I can't wait to see what you do with that 20 needle thing. What a nice thing to not have to change colors and thread all the time. Oh, and then I was watching somebody today. You don't have me watching these multi-needle things. This little short today, maybe this is what the hooping station is. Uh -huh. This lady went over to it. She put her shirt on it, and she just kind of went, and yeah. What you brand is that hooping station? That's uh, Mighty Hoops. Mighty Hoops. Okay. Or some, I think they have Hoop Master, but it's Mighty Hoops. You know who does a lot of that too? Like, I don't use mine that much. I showed Delonda yesterday it because I was like, girl, you need to get Mighty Hoops. Like, uh huh. You out. But Wana, Wana uses a lot of her, like, mm. she does a lot of Mighty Hoops um, stuff. Uh huh. Well, this thing I watched, it was awesome because the shirt went on this shirt thing and then she put her design where she wanted it and just it looked like she barely touched the hoop and it went. Just popped it in. Yep. It's so convenient. It is so convenient. Okay. Sheila says she's going on live at nine like usual. Okay. And Dim said that's the time that she put the thumbnail up was 848. Okay. All right, we got time. We're going to press this. We got five minutes to get it pressed. I don't know if I can get it pressed in five minutes, but we're going we're gonna, to we're gonna see y'all. We're definitely going to see if we can. I don't have that much more. Is that sapphire? Yeah, this is sapphire. And what uh, I didn't even notice the other color you used. I used black diamond and black diamond AB. How oh, cool. Oh, you are using Black Diamond AB. Good, I want to see it. That'll be cute. Black Diamond, Black Diamond AB, and Sapphire. The Sapphire, Sapphire in Black Diamond AB, like there's like a lot of blues in Black Diamond AB. Mm -hmm. So let me go ahead and use Sapphire. I thought it would look better than Capri. Yeah. With the shades of uh, blue. But I brought mine out for you. 19 months. 
Kevin, thank you for being here. And then here's for Patrice. <laughs> Marilyn's like, because y'all know her, her um, bell isn't going to ring, so I got to ring it for her. That's right. Thank you, Marilyn. That's what friends are for. The ring my bell. Uh -huh. Okay, I'll stop so you don't. <laughs> I'll stop so people don't, like, jump off the live. They'll be fine. They'll be fine. Hey, Viola. Okay, Viola said it sounds like a hooping station. It was so slick. Yes. It's a Was it a smaller item, like a shirt, like a, they were doing a left chest logo, maybe? That's exactly what they were doing. Yeah. That's their hooping station. She, I think she actually had it on the right, but, you know, sometimes the pictures are backwards. Mm -hmm. um, but, yeah, it was just a side chest logo. Nicole, I know, and that just awesome? <laughs> she put little musical notes in the chat for me. <laughs> Okay. All right, so we're getting ready to press, y'all. Let me see if I remember how to press this. Wait, let me put these rhinestones up first because whew, I don't want to mess up my sapphire. I right, put these up. We're gonna get ready to head over to the press. I already pre-pressed the shirt, so that is a good thing. I think I'm gonna just press over there so we could hurry up and. So while you're doing that. Pre-pressing is very important. I learned that out on that live when I was making the sublimation placemat. I didn't pre-press it. Well, I had pre-pressed it two weeks ago when I got to get the wrinkles out because they come super wrinkled. They come in like this vacuum packed bag. So I hadn't pre-pressed it. So I put my design on my placemat and tugged and pulled in all the different directions. And there was a little crease in it because I didn't get it smooth. So not only does pre-pressing remove moisture, but on more, like these are flowy, but the placement are is flowy. So it also gives you a super smooth surface when you are sublimating to get a really smooth sublimation. Not the stupid line I had. I wish I had it in here. I think I threw it away. I was so angry. Mirabel, do you want to show your shirt so that when we sure yes can you see it yes um so Kristen her bell is broken and that's why it doesn't make noise oh 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 not my bell is broken oh you're working the laundry she dropped it and that little middle part came out and so now she just shakes and shakes and acts like she's ringing it oh. and she claims that you can't hear it because of her noise cancellation. Y'all, my friends are a mess, y'all. <laughs> no, she she has noise cancellation so that the background <laughs> noises get canceled out. And so when she rings it, you might hear it for a second and then it goes away. Similar to, and I don't know if it's noise cancellation, but maybe you notice when she embroiders just for the first second or so, it's a little bit loud. And then you can barely hear the embroidery and you can hear her perfectly. And so when she's ringing her bell, that's that's why it does it. Her bell's not really broken. The Wanda says something's wrong with my bell. You <laughs> just said my bell was broken. I don't even know what I'm gonna do with her. <laughs> I have no idea. Um, Viola said, I love when she rings her bell, watches the expression on her face, it makes up for no bell sound. It does. She's like, <laughs> <laughs> she looks so cute. Like, I'm so <laughs> proud of myself because I'm ringing it really loud. Yep. Um, Nikki said she still doesn't see the design that I have on in your store. Let me let me show my shirt. This is a shirt that I did, and then I'll look while Patrice looks for her or while she shows her shirt. So I did Patrice's design, one crafty chick. For the outline, I used silver crystal metalites. For the word crafty. I use light cyan, and then for the inside of one and chick, I use what's called blue flame. Blue flame's not an AB stone, but it's a color shifting stone. So the, each stone has the same colors in it, but from different angles, you see different colors. So see all those different colors coming out in that? So pretty. Oh, that's so pretty. 
Michelle. Then a member 13 Yes, Michelle. Thank you for being here, girl. Okay, and then I think it was Mickey. Yeah, Mickey, let me look and see if I see her design. I put a link. I don't know if that's a good link, but I put a link. Also, can somebody drop Evie's link? Because we're about to be done in a second. Which one do a second? Oh. And maybe she made this when she was putting everything in her Etsy shop, but I'm looking. So that was on the website. This one is on the website. Okay. Oh, and you can even search on your website. So you think it might have the word kind in it? Yeah. Let me try that. That's nice. I found it. I found it. Okay, let me put this. If I can put the link in from StreamYard, I'm not sure I can, but let me try. Good night, Kawanda. Now I see. Oh, I can't. You can't? Wait, the chat. Let me join the chat. I see that she has two different designs in there. Maybe, maybe one is SS6 and maybe one's SS. No, I can't. Okay. So, Nikki, if you go to craftablethings.com and then her go to rhinestone designs or digital designs, I think it's called. Mm hmm. Her designs are searchable. Put the word kind in, and it's going to pull up two designs. Oh, I'm blabbing on, and Sheila already put the link up. Thanks, Sheila. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Sheila. <laughs> First of all, Sheila and, and Dims, like, you can't ever compete with them. So, I know. Just, you just let them do what they're going to do, Marilyn. Don't stress yourself out. I be stressing myself out sometimes, and I'm like, oh, here goes Dins. Dins uh -huh. like Only two or three times in the last three years have I beat Dins on putting a link up. She's beat me 159. And she that's probably because she was busy doing something. Yeah, or 259. Away. I don't know. I lost track at 150. All right, y'all. So I'm going to show, let me go over to my other camera. I'm going to show my design. Uh, Sheila, I think, listed, hold on, hold on, let me go. Sheila listed the link to head over to Evie's channel for our Sunday night hangout. And I'm just going to show the shirt set. So let me move this out of the way. Where's the table? That. All right, so... This was the shirt that I made earlier. Ooh. It's really, really pretty. We use Labrador for craft and the outline of bling. And then we use Jet Hematite for the, like here. I know y'all couldn't see that really good next to the A, the hyphens. And then inside of the word bling, we use Black Diamond at the top and Jet Black at the bottom. So that's, that's gorgeous. It. Thank you. This shirt is for Terrell. We're going to see if he wears it. And then the next shirt that I was telling you guys about, it's not on my website or anything, but I made it. it I know it says it, girl, but this is actually a cross. And if you see, like, the cross is covering uh, the What eye. in the world? Isn't what pretty? colors? Okay, tell us the colors again, because that inside of that cross is amazing. It looks so pretty. So we wow. use um silver black metal light for the outline and then inside is black diamond but the center of the cross like the very inside of the cross is black diamond ab that's what angel b had on i really need to use you black diamond ab and the girl is sapphire mm, that's pretty see how that black diamond you see how you get it with the black diamond and it's it's really pretty it's even prettier in person but it's so pretty so yeah that's our design this one's not in my store if y'all want me to put this in the store i'll put it in i've had it for a long time yes but, yes please look at me but this one is an ss6 design i only did my favorites tonight i did ss6 and i worked with my favorite colors but I think it came out really, really good. I've had this for a few months. 
Remember, I did a patch. I have the patches like this too. I did the patches like this. If you guys remember, I think it's one patch, one patch along we did, and I had this the patch. Everybody right. saying yes, yes, yes. Put it in. Okay, I will. Dim to she'll take the SS six. All right, y'all. Let me make Mary Bear big. We love you guys. Evie is on. Please head over to Eve's channel, The Baby's Booty, for her regular Sunday night live where Marilyn and I are about to head over there. Y'all will see us in the chat. Oh, but thank you for hanging out with us. Happy Easter. We hope you all had a great Easter. We hope you all enjoyed this live. We just want to come on and hang out with you guys for a little bit and we appreciate you spending time with us remember especially on this day of easter be kind be kind to everybody and love everybody like i know some people are a little bit much but they still deserve love too love them anyway yes so we love you guys and until next time